So you media is about what? Um, it's about a lot of things. It's about uh, the space in the library that students can come, high school students can come and hang out. Um, it's also a space that promotes literacy as we have book discussions and all the books are here. But uh, beyond that, it's about getting students engaged with digital media. So you know, we have the video games, we have uh, the laptops, the desktops, the Macs. And I, as a mentor, also teach digital media workshops. So we have workshops in graphic design, we have workshops in video, we have workshops in YouTube and Word. Um, it's really getting students to understand that there's, number one, a career in digital media, but more than that, um, expressing themselves creatively through media and putting that out there. Okay. Um, the different sections of the wall, what's that about? So there is research done about how students learn and that they move within three spaces. So the first space is a hanging out space. In the hanging out space, students just come and pretty much hang out. They talk to friends, they socialize, and then they move more so towards a messing around space where we physically have our desktops. On there, uh, they have iPhoto, iMovie, um, things like that where students can just come and play around with whatever media. If we have, you know, say for instance, a keyboard out or the DJ equipment out, students just come and mess around without any mentor guidance, just play around with it. And from there, once they develop an interest, we hope that they will then move to the geeking out space, mm -hmm. is where they become more in-depth with whatever they're learning. So if they're really into DJ, we then offer a workshop that will take place down at the hanging out space where they can get a workshop led by a mentor in how to DJ or how to create music, how to create graphic design. So the geeking out space is where they just fully like delve into whatever medium they become interested in. Okay, um, and my story is more focusing in on the recording studio in that part. Do you know a lot about that? A little? I don't know a lot about it other than it's there. Um, in the studio, students can create music. They record albums, they come in there, freestyle, they can work on the craft of music production and lyric writing and lyricism all together. So it's sort of a space where they can just come and record their music. And is there um, like a specific thing you have to do to get the... Yes, you be have to, to be certified. Um, we have offer certification for the studio, so a student cannot use the space unless they're certified. And through certification, they learn how to use the cables, how to use the equipment, uh, studio etiquette, because we want students to have the knowledge of not you just coming in the record, but how do you take care of a studio, how do you use a studio, how are things put together, how do they work. Um, so it's very important that students are certified first, so they know and understand the equipment that they're using. Okay, and um, in U Media in general, how do you get into U Media? How do, are you able to come in and just hang out, use the laptop to do any of it? You can come in as long as you are in high school or age, between the ages of 14 and 18, and you have a library card. The library card is magical. <laughs> it gets you laptops, gets you cameras, gets you the studio, gets you books. Um, as long as students have a library card and there's no fines, you know, late fees, or you, you remedy that, then they can come and use the space. Whenever they want. Whenever they want. Between the hours of one and nine. <laughs> so, like, I could literally come in with my library card and ID and... Uh-huh. As long as you have a library card, high school ID, as long as we know you're in high school, then you can come in and use space. And what about for those students that aren't in high school but um, aren't an alternative program, but they are still between the ages of what, 14 and 18? Okay. As, as long as they're of high school age, so we do have um, homeschool students that come in and are welcome to use the space. As long as they're between the ages of 14 and 18, they have ID to prove that they can come in. That's cool.